Welcome to the Frostburg Community Library. Opened in January 1999, this 10,400 square foot facility is located at 65 East Main Street in Frostburg, Maryland. The library features ample parking in the garage located under the building. An elevator in the parking garage will take you up to the library's front entrance lobby. Or you can enter directly from Main Street. Drop boxes on the right side of this front entrance allow you to return library materials even when the library is closed. In addition to the elevator, the front lobby contains the entrance to the John Bambakis Community Meeting Room. The Bambakis Community Room holds up to 45 people and can be reserved online for use by nonprofit groups. The room can be configured in many ways and features tables, chairs, a large screen television, and a projector screen. Now let's enter the library. As you enter, you will see spinning racks containing the library's paperback collection in front of you. To the right, you will find new adult fiction and nonfiction books that are available for immediate checkout. You will also see the library's circulation desk, where you can return items you have borrowed, check out additional items, or speak to a library staff member. On the left as you enter, you will see tables and chairs with plenty of natural sunlight and great views of Frostburg's Main Street. Feel free to sit here and read, work on homework, or just people watch. If you need a small space so your school group can work on a project together, speak to someone at the circulation desk or use the online form to reserve the study room. This space offers a table, chairs, and a big screen television to connect your laptop to, all in a semi-private space that is cozy without being cramped. The adult fiction books, located across from the study spaces, are organized alphabetically by author's last names, so you can find your favorite author or browse to discover a new one. Continuing past the study room, you will find the Gates Computer Lab. Made possible by a grant from the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation in 2003, this lab features 11 computers that are available to the public when the room is not being used for library programs. Check with the library staff member or see our online calendar to find out the topics and dates for upcoming computer classes offered by the library. Next to the computer lab, you will find a comfortable reading area where you can find magazines from the library's collection or browse the selection of items available for purchase. At the end of the adult fiction row near the magazine reading area, you will see the adult audiobooks on CD and digital player. Here you can find unabridged audio productions of both classic and contemporary bestseller titles. As you continue your tour past the magazine reading area, you will find a teen area designed for use by Frostburg's high school aged population. This area holds the fiction and nonfiction books, including manga and anime titles, that are part of the library's teen collection. There are also computers reserved for teen use. If you are between ages 12 and 18, feel free to Facebook with friends, connect to the library's online tutoring service, or type up your research paper on Microsoft Word. Across from the teen area, a spacious central aisle runs up the middle of the library. In this aisle, you will find additional computers available for public use. Let's walk down this aisle. The library's local history collection is on the left. And so are the adult nonfiction books, arranged into subject categories by Dewey Decimal System. Beyond the rows of computers, you will see drawers that hold DVDs, CDs, and video games. And now we have returned to the library circulation desk. Turn to the left to continue your tour. The SAM machine to the left of the circulation desk allows you to put money onto your library card. Doing this will let you print using the library's public access computers. The printer is located here as well. Just past the SAM machine and printer, we enter the children's area. The children's DVDs and audiobooks are on the right. Another seating area is across from the children's DVDs and audiobooks. Here you can read to your three-year-old or find a combination picture book and CD to take home. The train benches at the head of the picture book shelves are just right for our smallest visitors to climb aboard for a reading adventure. Against the wall in the children's area, there are two computers reserved for use by children 12 and under. Next to the computers you will see chapter books geared toward middle school aged readers. And the train depot displays new chapter books and new children's nonfiction books. At the back of the room stands a replica of the National Road Toll House in LaVale. 
join a children's librarian here each week for story time or toddler time. Ask a staff member or check the online calendar to find out the day and time of the next children's program. Thank you for visiting us here at the Frostburg Community Library. We hope to see you in person soon.